Guys, are you excited for uh, Friday, the Shabbat stream? I'm not putting on the hat, by the way. You have to. They're gonna try to put the little hat on you, the, the uh, yarmulke. You're doing it. Yeah, why did you have to put on the Jew chain for a while though? I always wondered that. Because it gave me, it gave me a good <laughs> luck in LA. Like, every time I got pulled over, they always gave me warnings. They told me to be safe, be careful. <laughs> was that part of a ritual? Like, did you have to do that to- <laughs> No, nah, it was literally just, just fucking, good luck. Oh my God. Just good luck. Like, so. But you're Christian, right? Yeah, of course. Well, well, how many days a week do you work? Five. That's every day. How is that last, Cheezer? Mimi, that's, that's, that's a nine to five. <laughs> Cheezer. That's so was she working seven before, Cheezer? Uh, oh, wow. What is he saying? Um, well, what's it called? How much, like, I'm not trying to be weird, but how much a month do you make? What's he saying? How much are you making a month? Should I tell you? No. Maybe. Why is he being... She's actually you really nice. <laughs> He has a great family. Can you, can you, can I say a number and you can tell me higher or over? Mm -hmm. Okay, say. Are you making 5,000 a month? Over. All right, well, I'm gonna uh, send you. What are you guys like, what is this? It's evil, Aiden. I'm gonna send you a year. That's evil for me trying to send her money? You know why this is evil? Because you're not doing it to like do a good person. You're like, look at that, a retired cheeser's mom. Yeah, like, it's I'm all really not. I know, because I know, it's all I know, I've known someone for like five years, so that's really, uh, mm -hmm. honestly. Yeah, yeah. Why are you But you're trying to big throw cheese and you're like, I'm the one who retired his mom. I no, own no, you. No, no, you're no. You're my little monkey now. <laughs> steak, steak, steak. <laughs> You're not doing it from the goodness of your heart. Yes, like, I am. Look what I did. It's like donating a million dollars to like a charity and then writing your name and gold on top of it. Like on a dead kid's that's, grave. That's not Aiden it. Aiden Ross. Like, Chad. Do it from the goodness of your heart. Do y'all actually believe that, bro? Anytime that I've ever blessed somebody, I just forget about it. It's just out of the kindness of my heart. I swear to God. And you guys will never know half the shit I do or 75% of the shit I do. I do a lot of off-stream for people. Jews just don't have hearts. Kodak White. <laughs> and of course, he loves it. I can't. No, Are you Kodak like White? Guys, I'm a Jew, I have a heart. There you go. Right? Sure. They AI translated this on TikTok and it got millions and millions of views and everyone's listening to it like, oh, this makes, because if you actually listen to what he's saying, he's like, we need to bring back Germany to economic restoration. We need to do the best and work together. We're nationalists, we're proud to be German. And it's translated, people like nodding their heads. TikTok got to ban it everywhere. Do you guys realize that if Nazis, or like, I know there's Nazis today, but do you guys realize if, That's he not kept, true. hold on. You guys realize if the Holocaust kept going on, you guys realize if like, Jews were being genocided and shit. I wouldn't be here right now. It was mostly a work camp. And it was the first time Jews had to do physical labor and so they just complained so much and created Israel. Like, <laughs> yeah, it, was, okay. it was mostly working. Okay, like, I'm just letting you know. We, Again, we, we you're laughing. Cotton. We were speaking cotton, I'm still here. Facts. Like, what you talking about? Because much harder. Who was it? That's way different. Yeah, but Auschwitz, hard. they had like pools, they had like basketball courts, they were chilling. Who? And then a lot of the, the, with the work camps, they had pools and they had yards to go. It's literally not true. Them. Like if it was, if it was straight up genocide. Why are they all skinny then? Why would, that's, a lot of that's not true. Why would they be feeding them? Also the gas chambers is like, bro, like. It was good. Gas. What? Like you said, Jesus Christ was a sinless prophet who was sent to spread the message of God. Jews believe that he's burning in poop and feces in hell. That's what? not true. That's, that's not true. That's Jews, actually true. Jews actually don't even believe in hell. So that's not true. In the Talmud, it says that Jesus is burning an excrement and feces. No, but listen, in the Torah, there's no hell. Like there's no hell. There's in no heaven either, right? There's heaven. There's just no, there's no hell. So what, every, they all go to heaven? I'm not saying that, but there's just no, there's, there's no, well, I mean, technically, yeah. There's no, there's no, uh. Well, there can't be heaven without hell, but it does say that in the Talmud. I could, I could even show you. It says Jesus burning an excrement and feces. You can see like the Israelis spitting on Christians when they walk by. That's what you Jew people believe in? They hate Jesus. What do yeah. you mean Jew people? Yeah, that's what we believe in. Yeah. So, and if you did, if you No, I to. actually, chat, the pork thing, I actually, like, actually do agree with. Like, I, pork, it, it, pigs yeah, taste why, why disgusting. You yeah, on, like, if you disgusting. think about it, it's like a disgusting, I actually do agree with that. I feel like you know, you know, shit. You, I they don't sweat, they're filled with bacteria. No, I, I agree with that. But actually. why are you guys allowed to eat it? Though? Because it's like it's like a dirty animal. animal. They're, they're dirty. Yeah. Yeah. We, Jews and Muslims agree on they that. They actually agree on that. Kosher food is also. Bro, Jews and food. Muslims are our cousins. Bro, at the end of the day, you got like it, no, they Abrahamic are Abrahamic faiths. Yeah, they are. <sighs> so you brought up nothing. You brought up stuff you agree with, but not well, 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 more stuff, more stuff. I don't think you can think of anything. I can for sure, bro. Wait, so sneak, you never ate bacon? No, of course. I, I didn't grow up Muslim. I grew oh. up Catholic. Oh, okay. Oh, what made you turn Muslim? I just saw it as the truth, like just the idea of one God. That's because we talk, we all believe in God. Right? Hold on, the whole chat's maybe underage and stuff. What can you go into detail about that? Because the entire chat's saying that. I don't, I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> underage. I mean, look, Jews become adults when they're 13. Yeah. Like, so technically, yeah, I'm a man at 13. That's 13. That's in, yeah. That's so based true. off that logic, you can marry a 13 year old girl. Like in all cultures, adulthood starts at a different time. I think you guys just drag it, basically, like what's being said. What the fuck is going on? Back in the back in the day with kings and queens, people would 
Mary oh, Queens right. at like what 15, 14 years Sometimes old. Sometimes like as soon as they get their period and shit. Yeah. There's that's... Christian kings that have uh, you know, Rebecca, she got married at three. Okay, yeah, you guys are putting question marks. I don't agree with that, obviously. I don't. But I don't. that's what it was at the time. At the time, that's what it really was. It was normal at the time in all societies ever. Why? Like not even in Christian like all over the world, it was normal. Yeah, guys, religion, no religion, that's what they believed in, right? Regardless though, chat, it's different now, right? Like, I mean, if you obviously marry a 16-year-old, 15-year-old, it's weird. Why? <laughs> wait, wait, what? I'm asking why. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you don't think that's weird? Okay, so, so is 17 weird? <laughs> I think it's a little bit, like, weird. Like, if, if you're... What about 18? How old are you? I'm 26. If, if you marry a 17 year old, I'd look at you a little bit weird. Okay, what about 18? I just, honestly... Can you, let me explain. Don't cut me off. I think, like, if <laughs> I'm 23, I should try to get someone, like, in, like, a three to four year age gap. Okay. But that's what I believe in. That so, like, you. If you're, like, 30... If you're, like, 30 and you date, like, a 38 year old, it's like, I guess it's different. I think it all matters about maturity, right? Maturity and experience. Like if, if, if a person's 18 and they're like kind of just fresh out of high school, they're not going to be the most experienced. Uh, uh, experience of what? Life. Okay. But I mean, everybody that, <laughs> all the celebrities that you hang out with, like all of them that come up, they all date girls that are 20, 30 years younger than them. Like Leonardo DiCaprio is with an 18 year old girl. Every but day. I call that out on my stream. You think that's weird? <coughs> I don't agree with it. Okay, you don't agree with it, but you think he's a weird person? I don't think I just I don't agree. I don't think he's a weird person. I just don't agree with that. Jay Z married Beyonce uh, met Beyonce Wait, when she was like fifteen. They got married, Beyonce what? was nineteen, he was thirty one. God damn. That's a big age gap. No one ever calls him a pedal. Like so what I mean, what's I, the Okay, can I ask you a question? Yeah. So when we did have this debate, right? I asked you if you had a daughter, I remember this. If you had a daughter and let's say would you would you rather her date a thirty year old right out of or, or would you rather her uh At what age? She's eight, she's eighteen. I don't want my daughter to date. Well, she's going to. No, she's not. What? My daughter's not going to date. But that's that's not you. You to control that. It's yeah, her life. If it's she's my 18, daughter. If she's no, eighteen, she can do what she wants. Yeah, she can do whatever. No, no. At eighteen, that's different. But but even then, like that's my daughter. I'm going to take care of her. The government's not going to parent my kid. I'm going to parent my daughter. My daughter's not going to date. I'm going to find her husband, and then she's going to agree, and then she's going to get married. So you're going to find her husband. Yeah. So you're do you talk agree to with that husband. though? What? Shouldn't she want to find who she wants to be with? Let her find people that... Like, I don't think women are good at making decisions like that. Like, if, if you let women choose, they always choose a bad boy, the biker, a drug dealer. When women choose who they date, they yeah, date the true. worst people of all time. Well, men, men, men get with girls sometimes that are not the best for them, too. You exactly. Gotta, They're but that's, but men let, have a predator mentality listen, because we just want to fuck. In life, you have to experience fuck-ups and mistakes to right. grow as a person and mature as a person and right. experience. Or, that's, or, that's part of growing as a person. Or father knows best and I can be like, I know what men are going to try to do. But so I'm going to, you can avoid her, all this. That's going to make her sneak behind Want more. Back. Like you're going to make her a rebel, bro. You're she's going to want to sneak, sneak out. Yeah, she's going to want to go to parties. She's going to want to do that shit, bro. I'm telling you. You're going to fuck up more. No, I'm, I'm going to tell her that this is not what's right for you. Uh, which country Spare invented tea? Wait, tea? Teep? Tea. He got it's England. I mean. Oh, oh, oh. What? Who invented it? France. No. Oh, see, we need this one. Yeah. Poland. No. Oh, okay. Yeah! Oh! China. Hold on to us. I'm getting to that. Who's uh, known for the father of modern physics? Oh, yeah. oh that's so easy, dude. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Hmm? Bro. Yeah. John Cena? No, it's not. Whoa! <laughs> They're not getting it. <laughs> I fucking get it. <laughs> Cheers. Is that hot? It's very hot, yeah. <laughs> Wait, just one? No, 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 I'm gonna chug the hot sauce now. Oh, right, you know what? Let's take it all outside. Oh, fuck me, dude. Their, their streamer only streams like once a week. <laughs> this is so fucking hot. Okay. <laughs> Get the flashlight. Can you still see me, Aiden? Yeah. That boy's shaking. Okay. Oh. Oh, I'm eating, bro. Okay. I also got. Uh, oh, dude. <laughs> I just got done having a cyclic vomiting syndrome episode. I've been throwing up on my bathroom floor for six fucking days. My dad's here to testify for that. I don't give a fuck. I'm doing this shit. You know what? We're coming back to that. Let's strike the other shit. Mouse trap. Legos in pieces. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna jump up to my deck under the fucking table. Oh god. Did it eat? Oh, hell. Oh, my. <laughs> so ass bone hurt. Come on, bro. <laughs> Why are you falling like that? Fuck, I put my eyes on the fucking girl. Oh, fuck. 
Quatiji. He's gonna fall forward. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay, no more of the okay. table. No more. No more? Yeah. Okay. He's crying <laughs> and shit. Oh my god. Now, I'm gonna get butt around in this pair Ew. a bunch of times, <laughs> and then when I get up, I'm gonna get tilted with a basketball and a chair. Bro. I'm gonna dizzy. <laughs> you do. Oh, I actually took the camera. Oh, I'm so fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Good, bro. How about you? Oh, I'm fucked up, Aiden. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I hope so, man. All right, bro. Just. Have... All right, bro. Holy shit. All right, bro. All right. All right. Oh, Sweet. This is not a good idea. Oh, it already went out. It already went out, bro. See? Give me one second. No, I don't know about this. Prisma on the grass, nigga. Yeah. He don't even know how to jump. Oh, oh my god. god. Right, it's his head at the. Oh, fuck. You okay? You all right? <laughs> <laughs> that was hard. Oh, man. Yo, just wind it. <laughs> you should have just one time bone. <laughs> Everyone's throwing it. There's we'll still a fire on the floor. Check the baby. Okay, light the baby on fire. Yo, bro, okay. Sneeko. Dude, dude, dude. dude. W dad. Yeah. W dad. <laughs> he's gonna eat, he's gonna put it on the bread and eat it? Yeah. Was oh. that Sarah? Are, what the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that in the background? What? Is that Sarah and Sneeko? Oh, God, dude. <laughs> so nice. Fried he's gonna smell terrible after. Oh, everyone's throwing up. <laughs> is Indian food that bad? I thought it's pretty was good. That's why they smell bad. Yeah. Look You lost a ball for real? What the fuck? This nigga just cracked Damn. a whole egg inside of his fucking yeah. mouth. Did he eat the shell? Did he eat the shell? Yes. Holy shit. Can you die? Oh, God. No way he's about to swallow the shell. Yo, he did. Oh! Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, he's good. Oh. He's good! Yeah. He's good! Yeah! Yeah! yeah. 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 Wow, he got on fire too. That was quick. <laughs> At least he didn't run all the way there. Good, Good. stuff, bro. That was quick. So here's your caterpillar. Alright. Here's your caterpillar. Oh, hell. Just dump it on your hand so we can show the camera. Let's get everybody with the caterpillar in your hand, please. These are big ones, Aiden. I got literally the biggest ones I can find. Look at the size of these caterpillars. Isn't that sick? That's so cool. Yeah. So everyone's got one. Uh, we're gonna go one at a time. Domino's gonna eat the first one. We're doing one at a time? Yeah, one at a time. Go ahead and eat yours up. Oh shit! Okay, you'll get something to drink. Chill These it. are very watery. You don't oh, need something God. to wash it down. You'll be just fine, I promise. Yo, he just Do you like it? Mm. Is it good? Oh, is it better than last time? That was mad dirt. Oh, is it better than oh, last time? Oh, yeah. Give it all a tasty gummy worm, Aiden. He's not even here. We're all like... Oh, yeah, shit. Oh! It just nutted! Oh, my God! It just nutted! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! We oh, 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 keep them yellow as fuck, bro. Holy shit! Three, one! There you go. Ah! Ah! Get it down there. Oh! I know that shit tastes like shit. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Oh, my God. Get it down. Get it down. Get it down. Get it down. Yes! 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 Okay. Oh, God. okay. I kind of have the hard stuff coming up now. <coughs> right here, Damn, bro. Um, I poured three glasses of. I, I made it myself actually. I'm kind of a chef now. I ordered cyan. Hey, quiet. Let me see. Up. I ordered cyan powder. This is some of the hottest pepper in the world. I got like the extract, and I just got massive spoonfuls and cooked up some hot drinks. I want you guys to chug the entire thing. This is a race. Um, whoever taps out is not going to be moving on. So, oh God. I'm gonna need you guys to just really give this your all. I honestly don't think anybody's gonna be able to accomplish this. So we might have a pity rule if nobody can succeed. But um, like go ahead and start drinking. Oh my God. Just so you guys know, this is literally the hottest thing I've ever seen in my life. It was so- He chugged it, what the fuck? He missed a lot. Hey, what the fuck? Did you- Oh. <laughs> oh, Alright, we've got some, we've got some throw up coming in already. I saw the caterpillar come out. Over. He wants to mousetrap their nipples, I guess. Mm. Hey, please be quiet. No. Blakey, no. dude, just go slap the cheese onto the nipple. Oh, okay. Alright. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah, ready when you are. Let's do it. 
Oh. All right, wait. We need another one. We're getting both, buddy. Oh. Don't, the other one. don't make that call oh. you to throw up. We used to go to war, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we used to fight battles and conquer. Go to my brother. Right on the mommy milkers. Okay, right. Jesus. All this for a band is crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> is that it? Hey, yeah, honestly, bro. Blake, you gotta improve your aim, bro. It's kind of embarrassing. Uh. Okay. Do like you mean it. Oh, that was basically. I'm, I'm gonna ask you to uh, leave that on. What the fuck? Ah! 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 Ah!
Holy shit. Oh, it's the Matrix music. Remember, this is only supposed to be disturbing for one person. Or it's not one person, five people. And, uh, he's doing it to himself. Watch him. Um, Scar me for life, so I can imagine this. Dude. Is it hotter? Uh, yeah, maybe. Oh. A little bit spicy. Uh, I think this is like six hot chips. Shut the fuck up. That's how hot it is, bro. So how many hot chips is this? Eight oh eight, actually. It's level three. It says this is eight hot chips. Not gonna lie, it tastes like fucking dog shit. You feeling drunk yet? Bro, he's drunk. I call oh, no, he's drunk. He's drunk. I call him put spicy shit in his body. He's fucked. Uh, you're gonna smell like, like, imagine the shit you're gonna take out of this. No, to put it in for, uh, perspective for you, that shit you had, this is like eating 20 of those in one go. I know, that's what I'm oh saying, nigga. God. That shit, I can imagine that, nigga, because I was crying. Yeah, he got some ice cream or some milk? Damn, one more? Shit. Oh my god, the death nut. Hey, I appreciate you, Aiden. I appreciate you. Of course, brother. Imagine the smell of that room right now. He's not done yet. We have the world audit pepper. No, he's gonna die. The Reaper X. Bro, he's gonna AKA die. Pepper like, do we not love his brother? Like, he wants his brother to die? This is the audit pepper. <laughs> No, like, is this legal? <laughs> Nigga, he's your brother. He's your brother, bro. Ew. Nigga, do you hate your brother or something, bro? The last three streams? Dude, he looks retarded. We're the fucking king. <laughs> I think he's retarded. He paid the way for Derek to be this crazy. If he well, needs two, it's a world record. Wait, it's actually a world record? Do it. Oh, hell no. Do it. Two's a world record. Look at how thick they is, bro. I'll, I'll be two. That looks like Zah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. God, he did it. He did it. That's a world record for the most hot shit ever. No, for eating two peppers. Also, I only ate one before. And you got a bottle of honey in his stomach right now. It's the hottest pepper I have seen. Damn, world record. I'm tearing up. So the average person with this amount of heat would be on the ground right now, passed out. He is still standing. Said he's taking the amount of six million Jews, like of heat. Like you're so weird. W. Damn, L. Except this actually happened. All right, look, man. You said you consumed how much? Nineteen million. So I'm gonna give you nineteen thousand dollars. Me too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you you did your thing, baby. Good shit, dude. How did he not throw up? Hold, on, let me call Sneeko AI. What the hell? What's the name oh, of it, bro? Yeah, that's our first time. Do you like there. Andrew Tate? Yeah, I like Andrew. He inspired me to become better. I have not met him before, but I know of people who know him, and the things I hear about him and how he treats people is all positive. Um, I think media just does the most to make him look bad. Are you guys cool? I wouldn't say we're close enough to hang out, but there's mutual respect between us. It, it's nice to have someone that is a successful role model out there. It gives people like me hope that we can also achieve the things he has achieved and much more. Do you look up to him? Yeah, totally. He's doing well and is more successful. Yo, he has great work out there. Smart me ask me a question. So, do you think Pammy is attractive? Yeah. She is beautiful. Yo. She's like top 1% of women easily. Yo. <laughs> do you? Nah. Do you still take MDMA? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Diddy, are you guilty? Oh. So now you want to play the blame game? Guilty of what exactly? Making money, making moves, or just being good at what I do? Be honest, did you sleep and put baby oil on an underage Justin Bieber? Ha, that's a good one. But unfortunately, I'm, I'm not at liberty to discuss anything that may or may not have happened between me and Justin Bieber. As far as I remember, we, we just had a few business meetings and maybe a quick game of, of poker. That's all. Yeah. You poking him in his ass. That's an interesting mental image you have there. But let me assure you, my relationship with Justin Bieber was strictly professional. Did you ever sleep with Aiden Ross at a Mike Rubin party? <laughs> you asked some really out-of-the-box questions, so for Panther 159. 
but i can honestly say that i have never slept with anyone at a mike rubin party let alone aiden ross my focus is on business and music and i keep my personal life separate from the hustle are you innocent well now that's a subjective question isn't it technically i suppose you could say i'm innocent in the sense that i've never been found guilty yep what? Wait, what? Oh, oh, no, uh, uh, that is not him. That's that a is Eden. The video is fake. No, it's Eden. Yo. Who oh, bet is this? No, it's not. Put a crown on your head. Who is? You're like 15, bro. Wait, do y'all know me? Yes. Yeah. 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 no. No. Nah. <laughs> yeah, I get you. Yeah. You remember when Aiden Ross went bald for you? He's pretty much bald already. He's getting fat too, right? He's not fat, he's bulking. What do you think about Sneeko? I've got a lot of mixed feelings about Sneeko. On one hand, I think it's very honorable how loyal he is to me. However, on the other hand, he sometimes comes across as a little too cocky and immature. Why are you talking shit? Mm. I'm not talking crap, mate. I've got respect for Sneeko and I like the guy. I just think his, his ego sometimes gets in the way of him making good decisions. Is it true that you're the reason why he converted to Islam? Well, to be fair, I had a good influence on Sneeko. I think the fact that I converted to Islam and it's worked out well for me made Sneeko curious about the religion. That's just not true at all. You'd want to take credit for everything. Bro, I'm not trying to take credit for everything. I just have a significant influence over Sneeko. I'm the reason why he started boxing, and I'm the one Yo. who taught him how to be more masculine. Oh this is God. not true. I wanted to convert to Islam ever since I read the Malcolm X book, and I've been boxing ever since I was 19. Don't, don't try and act like it was all your own doing, mate. Yo. We all know you started boxing because I inspired you. Yo. And don't deny that I've had a big impact on your life generally. You wouldn't have been as successful on YouTube oh as you are God. today Yo. without me. Yo. That's not true at all. I got banned on YouTube like two months after I saw your videos. I don't even have a channel anymore. <laughs> Watch me go actually talk to him. Like <laughs> you retard, you ruined hey, it. Fucked it up, bro. Oh, you're such a stupid, four eyed, <laughs> peanut brain. And you're a kike and you're a hunky. Hitler rules the world. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I got banned on YouTube like two months after we met. Like a week after we met. That's bullshit, bro. You got banned for being a little snitch, but you were already going hard on YouTube when you were working with me. I helped you get to a million views on a video, bro. You have to be thankful. I had a million subscribers two years before I even started streaming. I've been well known for a long time making videos. What are you taking credit for all the time? Cause you have a, B a Bugatti? I have 10 Bugattis, mate. And I also helped you reach new heights. Oh. So that million subscribers was all you. But being the most subscribed creator in the world and making millions of dollars wasn't all you. Oh. You had a lot of external factors. Okay, there's a lot of external factors. So why are you trying to take credit for it solely? I'm not taking full credit. I'm just saying that as your friend, I had a positive influence on you. You wouldn't be who you are today without me. Oh. I've had more of a positive influence than you've had a positive influence on me. No, you haven't. I'm the one who got you into making content, boxing, reading, and religion. Oh. None of that is true, first off. Do you even think you're innocent? Bro, I don't think. I know I'm innocent. That's good. See, there wasn't a lot of people that were speaking up about your case in the beginning. It was just me and Aiden. I don't care who believes my case. The only people who matter are the people who are close to me and the people who support me. I've got plenty of people supporting me. Way more than people who are trying to cancel me. The haters will always hate. <laughs> Should I go to Rumble or Kick next year? Go to both, mate. Keep your options open and don't limit yourself. That's actually pretty good advice, AI Andrew. Thanks, I always give good advice. But people these days don't like good advice. They like the same old bullshit. Do you wanna have sex with me? Okay. <laughs> Do you wanna fuck me? Hello? Bro, I know you miss me and I miss you too, but this is a little inappropriate. Sorry. Why are you giving me attitude? I just said I miss you, bro. Do you miss Nico? Of course I miss my son. He's a good kid. Dude! But he's got a good head on his shoulders. Fuck off! <laughs> Shut up! Bro, what's up with this attitude? We used to be friends. We were like brothers. <laughs> Go to Danny, go to Danny. No, I'm not doing that shit. Yeah, come no, on, I'm not come on, giving come on. her attention, bro. No. Oh some... my god, how many times you bring up like? It's you that shit? brings it up, weirdo. I'm not gonna. <laughs> no. Okay. 
You know, gonna, you know who I'm going to bring up too, bro? Well, okay. I still think about you. We're cut from the same cloth. That's kind of gay. No, that's called being bros, bro. When bros got to separate, they miss each other and have an emotional bond. But you're probably not used to that, that the most because one? you grew up without a father. What? Yo. Okay, first off, I have a dad. He's a great dad. What are you talking about? Don't talk about my parents, buddy. Bro, my bad. I didn't mean to say that. Of course your dad was a great guy. I didn't mean to insult him. But in my opinion, your relationship with your dad could never compare to what you and I had together. Bro, stop talking crazy. You're sounding weird. And it's good that you apologize, bitch. Bro, stop being like that. I'm genuinely apologizing here. I didn't mean to say nothing bad about your dad. But...